Oh, we got a good one right here, y'all. Whoa. Whoa. Holy cow. Babe, I got a huge one right here. He's fighting real good. Ooh, he looks like a red breast sunfish too, y'all. Here you go, babe. Woo! I got a good one, guys. Oh, he's a that's a green sunfish. There we go, guys. We got another, ooh, got another species. Oh wow, babe, there you go. Oh, oh my god, she just slapped me in the face with a fish, y'all. <laughs> Literally. We always say that to each other so we can find a way out. Mine's bigger than yours. Yeah, he is. All right, guys, there's mine on the right. Green sunfish. And the angel's got her a bluegill right there. Woo! We're on the freaking money. Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. We got a good one, everybody. Oh, this is the biggest one yet. Oh, yeah. Is that good, Rivy? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, he's tearing up that fish, y'all. He loves it. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm. What do you think about the fish, Nikki? You like bluegill? Fried bluegill is absolutely delicious. It's yummy. Well, y'all, this bluegill came out just excellent. Got a nice curl, fried up nice. Mm. Hey everyone, Zach here. Today we're going to do a little pan fishing. Ooh, I already see a couple down there by that rock, but yeah, y'all, I've been here a couple times with Alec and uh this is the land of the big bluegills i'm talking the big ones the huge ones i don't know if y'all see that but that's just a big old weed bed right there and there's weeds everywhere and this creek is home to just some really big sunfish you gonna pull hey guys one? you gonna pull one up too babe yeah sweet so i'm excited y'all I'm about to get all rigged up and uh, we're gonna drop a worm down here and see what we can't do. Okie dokie guys and gals. Today I'm gonna be using the ultralight, the micro light glass. Woo! It's just a really whippity pole. And I got my Daiwa reel with two pound test line. The two pound line I'm giving the fish a chance, you know what I mean? A fighting chance to, you know, fight. Hopefully we catch a big fish and I'm gonna play it out. We're gonna have some fun. I brought the cooler today, y'all. It's got a measuring board on it too, so if I catch a big one, we'll measure them for you. And I got the ice in there. Got the worms in there. The wormies. And if, we, if we catch a couple big bluegill, y'all, we're gonna throw them in the bucket. And we're gonna cook them for you guys. All right, y'all. Let's try to. This is just a night crawler. There's a big bluegill in this pond, so I'm gonna put his butt on hole. Thread him on there. Oh. Oh, you brought my pool? I didn't know you did. Nicholas, help the baby put something on. All right, y'all baby's rigged up got the point sticking out sorry all right all right y'all looks like my bobber stop i got it set to about almost six feet it's probably too much we'll start at like two feet see what happens Hey, we're just on top of this bridge, y'all, and we're gonna, I'm gonna drop this thing down. Oh, I'm gonna come on this side. Drop it down right. I guess right there. Let's see if something. Uh oh. Looks like it's moving, y'all. Oh, oh. 
Gotta make sure my drag's set good on this one because we're using two pound line, y'all. Oh, I think we got something. Or something on our worm. <laughs> it's okay. Oi! All right, guys. I don't know what's going on, but I think the fish might be spooked by my bobber, so I'm going to take that bad boy off. I got a fish! <laughs> You want to come show the camera? Or you want it that bag? Angel wants. Angel wants to show her fish, everybody. He's Ooh. a little, freaking. Super little. We're trying to get the monsters. There's monsters in here. <laughs> we just gotta get them to bite. Strike. Yeah, he's an all right one. He ain't no huge one, but he's actually, he's a pretty one. He's down there fighting, y'all. Hoi! There we go. Whoa. Sorry, y'all, I'm showing Angel, but woo! There we go, there's our first fish of the day. He's kind of small for the frying pan. Angel just said she caught two, and it's not the first fish, but it's the first fish for me. Yeah. Well, yo, how about we throw the first one back? He looks like a good old catfish bait, though. I'll tell you what, a flathead would gobble him right up. Just a regular old bluegill, y'all. Woo! See if we can do that again. See if we turned them on. It's been about 20 minutes. We've been here about 20, 30 minutes, right? Not that long yet. Oh, that one already got eaten, y'all. Oh, this is a better one. Here we go, babe. I got a good one right here. Got another one? Yeah, he's fighting down there. Oh man, he's trying hard to shake that hook, y'all. This one's, we're keeping this bad boy. The back one? Oh, I hate doing this. Hell yeah. I hate doing woo! this with two pound line, y'all, but woo! Show them how big with your hand. Now that one. That's good eating. You want to eat him, babe? Yep. All right. Bluegill happens to be one of my favorite fish to eat. Really delicious. There we go, y'all. I don't know if you heard Angel, but she said it's one of her favorite fish. Oh, and the hook came right out. Look at that. Well, Guys, babe. Zach caught one. Woo! There's one good one. Show them with your hand. Not really no big and yet. But he's he's pretty good size for eating. He's a good eater size, right? Yep, we're going to eat him, and we're going to vlog it, how we make this into a family meal. All right, babe, throw them in the cooler for me. Okay. Oh, babe, get him. Get him, get him. Grab him, come on. Sweet and tight. She got him, y'all. Oi! <laughs> Still got my worm, too, I guess. Kind of looks like crap, but I guess we'll toss it back out there. It's the worst that could happen. Like we already had another bite, y'all, right when that thing hit again. Oh, yeah. Oh, there it goes. I told you in that little cove right there, right? Yeah. 
Oops. Something nibbled at it, but he didn't get it. Just watching that line, y'all. Just waiting for it to go tick. This is such a little sensitive ultralight rod. Whenever I've, even with this two pound line, I, when those fish bite, I feel it. Oh, we got a good one right here, y'all. Whoa. Whoa. Holy cow. Babe, I got a huge one right here. He's fighting real good. Ooh, he looks like a red breast sunfish too, y'all. Huge one? He felt pretty good when he was in those weeds, but... He looked a little bit little? No, he's not little. He's the same size? Well, oh my gosh, babe. I think he's a little bigger than that last one. All right, let's make sure he's settled down. All right, guys, Zach caught another fish. Oh. oh. He's a little bit bigger than the other one, huh? Right? Yeah. <laughs> There we go, everybody. Yay. He looks, some dinner. he looks more like a bull gill. See his head? He's got that lump. They're so good for eating. Oh, yeah. He's that old knot head, y'all. Look at that bad boy right there. Well, there we go. Another Yay. good, Another good eater. You going to throw them in, babe? Yep. Let me grab them. Let me grab them by the bottom. All right, y'all. Angel's okay. got it. She's throwing them in the cooler. Ooh, this one actually feels. Oh, he let it go. Oh, he felt heavy, y'all. Gosh darn it. Ooh, it's getting hot out here, everybody. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, he's a good bait size. Babe, will you? I'm sorry. Will you scoot that cooler closer to me, please? Please, honey. I love you. you Don't let the bluegill get the best of you, babe. Yeah. All right, y'all, we'll throw him back. Boy! <laughs> Angel's chilling with the baby for a minute. He got a little fussy. But I think something just ate that entire worm, y'all. I can't tell if we got something or not. Or if we're just in the weeds. Oh. Kind of looks like we're just in weeds. <laughs> Y'all see this thing I'm freaking pulling? With my two pound line. We got lucky when we lifted that up. <laughs> we still got our hook. Okay, everybody, I'm doing a little, sh little shimmy. My son River wanted to get out of the car, so we'll do a little walking with him. Where are you going, River? You're just going? He's just going, y'all. <laughs> Ever you can come out here and spend the good old day with the family can't beat it what do you see come on let's go look Ooh. I know Ooh. what do you see Hemi river river what do you see you see any fishies? Oh. Okay, y'all. I'm gonna hang out with River for a little bit. Let Angel do some fishing. And uh, I'll turn the camera on whenever she catches something. We'll find out, though. Oh, Angel said, I'm coming. on here you go babe Woo! i caught a good one guys oh he's a that's a green sunfish 
There we go, guys. We got another, ooh, got another species. Same difference. Honestly, baby's not a real huge one. But I caught a good one compared to the other ones I caught. All right, should we put them in the cooler? Yes. Put them by, grab them by the mouth. Look, they got bigger mouths. You put them in there. There we go, y'all. There's Angel's green sunfish. Let me show you guys in the light. There we go. Good job, babe. He ain't too bad, yo. He's hand size. Not pan size, but he's hand size. We're looking for that bluegill that's as big as the frying pan, babe. All right, y'all. I'm tired of getting robbed, so we done hooked up another worm on the slip float. Six pound trout mono with good old eight pound braid. There we go. We're going to get them now. I know we are. I have to get them now. Oh, wow, babe. There you go. Show the camera. Oh. oh, my God. She just slapped me in the face with a fish, y'all. <laughs> Literally. We always say that to each other, too, when it finally happens. Mine's bigger than yours. Yeah, he is. All right, guys. There's mine on the right green sunfish and then angel's got her a bluegill right there Woo! we're on the freaking money yeah yours is about a freaking inch longer than mine good job babe yay can we throw mine in the bucket too <laughs> all right y'all that last one swallowed the hook so i'm tying me another knot here Y'all just know whenever you fish with worms, your hands and fingers, they're going to get dirty. They are going to get dirty. <sighs> I grabbed a new worm, but it looks like we don't need them yet. It was at your feet. Let's toss that worm back out there. Just fishing this baby slow, just Oh, and it's all bobber. Oh! It went under for a second. Oh, there it goes, y'all. I don't know if he's got it yet. It just got dunked. Oh yeah, we got a good one, everybody. Ooh, this is the biggest one yet. Oh yeah. Is he all right, babe? I told you to watch him. What about this one? Whoa, Whoa y'all. This is what we came here for. Look at that bad boy. Ooh, he's huge. And he's got beautiful colors. Let's see if I can get it in the sunlight so I can show you guys. It's just a, not a hybrid. He's just a straight bluegill, but man, he's got a big old eyeball. Look at that. He saw that worm and he wanted it. And we got a good, a decent hook set too. There in the corner of the mouth. That's my biggest one yet today, y'all. He's I'll show you compared to my hand. Can't even see my hand, that sucker's they're getting bigger, y'all. See if we can get a nice thick one. 
Go put them in the bucket. Grab another worm. Oh, we still got a worm. Okay, gotta be careful, y'all. Oh, wait. If I fall right here, it ain't gonna feel too good. All right, y'all. We're starting to come up with a little mess here. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven of them in here. got to take her oh this one feels like a real good one y'all oh guaranteed this is a good one oh he's down there fighting oh it's a bass hmm, no wonder oh wait now it's a bass yeah. There we go, yo. Woo! You want to cook them or? Fuck it, throw them in there. We gonna eat whatever we catch, guys. So his little butt is going in. Hey, babe. <laughs> God, Angel caught another freaking big one, y'all. Woo! Yeah! I'm talking, that's a good one. Let's turn it into a good video, babe. We're freaking racking them in now. Hell yeah. Woo! God dang, he's a heavy one. <laughs> you can tell when you set the hook, right? Jackson, you want to catch the shirt back already? Okay. Trying to make it count. <laughs> oh. I think that's what it is, y'all. I think they're close to the bank. They're spawning still. This has been fun, y'all. Got a bass, a couple bluegill, a bunch of bluegill, a bunch of good ones too, y'all. I'm talking good eaters. It's been a long time since I did a bluegill fry. I'm excited about that. I'm coming! We at least gotta end this on a fish, guys. Mmm! There we go. Ooh, this one's pulling pretty good. That's another bass. Alright, guys. That's the last fish. Family's ready to go. It's hot. All right, I'm coming. Hi. Right. What's up, everybody? Zach here. Right before I was making my outro out there, I was going to show you all the fish. Gosh darn camera died on me, and you know. Oh my gosh. Just had a hornet fly on top of my GoPro while I was holding it. Whoa. But all right, let me show y'all what we got here. Got my fillet knife so I can clean this fish up. Mm. There's one of our fish we're gonna eat. And here's a haul of our bluegill. Angel was killing it today, y'all. She caught most of these big ones. Look at that good one right there. Big one right there. So we did pretty good today. Nice green sunfish right there. A little green sunfish, they got a little bit different of a look. They got a bigger mouth. They're just pretty fish. I feel like they eat more minnows than bluegill do. There's another green sunfish. So yeah, y'all, there's our haul right here. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna get to cleaning these bad boys and after I get them all cleaned up, I'll show y'all what the product looks like. Alrighty, everybody, that's my last fish. 
I'd inflate all these bluegill up real nice. Look at that. I done got all the meat off of those suckers. Nothing left. Just bare skin. And what do I think we're going to do later tonight, after we eat some dinner, do a little fry, we're going to take all these heads to the river. See if we can catch a big old catfish. And then I brought these little rib meats as you know, maybe a big catfish will eat it, but maybe a small catfish or a channel catfish or just a good eater. We'll eat those. So we're gonna use these as bait. Not that. And uh yeah. <laughs> There's our plate of fillets. Oh, we actually got a freaking bunch from all that uh bluegill. Sorry, y'all. Got to make sure that old front door is shut because uh, I got three bloodhounds and last thing we need is them getting out. So the easiest way to fillet these bluegill, y'all, if you're going to fillet them and not cook them whole, is the electric fillet knife. I mean, it thing, this thing works wonders. You got to have a really, really sharp knife if you're not. So here we go. Let me show you how I do it. Here we go, flip them over. You wanna cut that rib meat out. Okay, and then just take the filet off. Oh man, that electric filet knife works wonders, y'all. I mean, I know it's a small filet, but they taste great. Here's a short. There we go. All right. Oh, we can't forget our head. That's what, that one's a bait. Hey, at least when we go to the river, we don't have to look for bait. Yeah. Nicole's this out for free. All right, everyone. I'm going to get all this cleaned up, bag this stuff up, and uh, take this to the kitchen and clean it up. And I'll see you all in the kitchen. Woo. All right, everybody, we're back in the kitchen. You want some? Here's our fish fillets. I done cleaned them up. All right, so we're going to get our fish. Throw it in the bag. Next time, we're going to catch about twice as many bluegill. And we're gonna marinate it in this Valentina right here. Hey, Maggie. What's up, Maggie? Brewster. These are my bloodhounds, y'all. Got three of them. Got three of them. This is my boy right here. What's up, Roo Roo? All right, guys. So we're gonna flay our fish right here. Or, I'm sorry, we already filleted it, but we're gonna put, we're gonna marinate it. Marinate. Is it dark? All right. Nope. All right, everybody. The way I like to make my fish fry is with flour and cornmeal. I put just a little bit more flour than cornmeal because that's just, that's the way we like it over here. So I'm gonna put some salt. Salt always brings out the flavor and everything. Some chili powder. Some chicken bouillon. I'm just gonna put a little bit of this stuff. Mm, it's 
smells so good. I've come to realize, y'all, I like my food spiced up. Not necessarily hotter than hell, but I like it to have a good flavor to it. So we use some crushed red pepper too. I feel like the crushed red pepper, y'all, that really, if you want your fish fry to have a nice spicy flavor, use that. Little bit of Italian seasoning. Some cayenne pepper. Last fish fry we did with uh, my brother David, we mm -hmm. loaded up the spicy seasonings in it. It was so good though. Was it? It was delicious. There we go, y'all. Some good old garlic powder. And we're not going to forget the sweet potato fries because those were a hit last time. Is that what you want to do? Sweet potato fries? Mm -hmm. Some paprika. I like to put a good amount of paprika because it's not very spicy. And I like the way it tastes. And some onion powder. I'm not going to put a whole lot of onion powder. That's enough. And then black pepper. I love pepper. I don't know about you guys, but whoo! There we go. Mix this up real nice. Nice and thorough. All right, guys, Zach's over here making a mix for the um, fish nuggets. I keep wanting to say crappie. I am so sorry. We had a lot more crappie fries than bluegill fries, so it's all I think I... we've had one other like bluegill fry, right? We've had, I think we've had like two or three, but we don't do them a whole lot. It's been, I think it's been over, it's probably been two years since we've done a bluegill fry. I usually cook, but the man's cooking today and he. And this evening we are make uh, we have garlic powder, uh, crushed red pepper. All right, guys. Powder. I'm gonna get the oil on. Get it, get it hot. Pepper. All right, everyone. I just cut up our sweet potato wedges. The wife said she wants sweet potato fries. She likes them old sweet taters. And if y'all are wondering, yes, I washed my hands. They're so yummy. We're gonna put some of this on there, babe. Adobo. Yes. I don't know about y'all, but this makes every potato, burger, vegetable, fish. Everything. It makes it I put this crap on everything, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> this is good as Frank's. Oh, dude, heck yeah. All right, y'all, so we got the potatoes frying. We got the fish fry ready. I'm gonna keep letting the fish marinate until the potatoes are all done. And then... And by the way, it's not crap. It's actually very delicious. I don't know why I said crap. It's because I was fixing to say another word, but sorry. This is absolutely delicious. Go get you some. <laughs> all right, y'all. I'm gonna get some regular potatoes ready because uh, Angel, she loves sweet potatoes. Zach's not a fan. I'm not the hugest fan of sweet potatoes. I like them, but it's just not my yeah, favorite. I'm them for I guess. All right, y'all. So I think I'm gonna do this one a little different. Not wedges, but let's do some chips. All right, y'all, I'm gonna keep cutting these chips and I'll get back to you once once we're uh, getting that fish ready. What are you talking about, River? Huh? What are you doing? No, 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 hey. 
Take it easy, boy. Well, yeah, babe, yeah. are the sweet potato fries good? Absolutely delicious. <laughs> Just hot? Mm hmm. <laughs> okay, everybody. Here's our fish. Let's go ahead and put it in our mix here. Okay, y'all, our fish is evenly coated. We'll throw that in the sink. All right, everybody, when my chips are done, we're gonna go ahead and get that fish in the fryer. Woo! We're about to. You ready to eat some bluegill? Yeah. Yes? Mm-hmm. Doki. Is that good, Rivy? Yeah? Oh, he's tearing up that fish, y'all. He loves it. Look at that. Mm-mm-mm. Yummy. Woo! All right, River's eating at his little table. Oh! I'm gonna sit down with Angel. She's already demolished some of the potatoes. Jeez, I wasn't by myself. I did too. I'm hungry. Mmm. What do you think about the fish, Nikki? Good. You like bluegill? Fried bluegill is absolutely delicious. Mm -hmm. What do you think is better, bluegill or catfish? Both. Both? You like them both? Mm -hmm. Okay. What do you think, babe? It's good. <laughs> I really, I really, because we caught one bass and we mm -hmm. cooked it. It was really good too. That one's really good. And the largemouth? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I really like it. There's his filet right there. There's the largemouth mm -hmm. filet. It's yummy. Well, you know, this bluegill came out just excellent. Got a nice curl, fried up nice. Mm. It's so good. This is one of the best fish fries I've had in a while. This is yummy. As far as the flavor goes. Yeah. The flavor of the meat just tastes excellent. It's absolutely delicious. Well, guys, we'll see y'all back at the lake. Whew. This has been a fun catch and cook. It's been a really fun day. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, shoot me a like and subscribe, and I'll keep bringing the content. And if there's a catch and cook that I haven't done that y'all want to see, just let me know. And I swear, I'll do it. But until next time, y'all, thank you for watching. I'll see y'all in the next one. Over and out.